What up dogs, TV here, and today I got a Hearthstone video. Yes, I know you guys are super excited about some Hearthstone, and today is actually the last day um, that I will be Legend on the first time I ever got Legend, and of course I'm playing this amazing deck called Handicapable, aka Ancestral Druid. Um, I probably lost maybe 15 games with this and won 10. I'm having a blast playing it though. I, I feel like when I'm on Legend, I should maybe play super serious deck and just try to rank up and all do that stuff. But I'm not really. I'm playing like a really stupid crazy deck. And it is so much fun. The only thing is that it's not great. But if you draw Jaw, Jazari, Rage Unbound, you can. You can win some games. Uh, if you top deck that after you have um, Astral Communion or Astral Communion. Oh, there is, but I don't know if we're if we would get an astral communion. We probably have to play it like next turn. Um, that will be a top deck of the lifetime. Also, so good. The Slitherer is also a really good card. It is totally untargetable by um, all these like rogues. They're playing. I even met a mill rogue in this like dumpster ranks. Whatever the people are, are teasing me about. I don't really think it's a. <gasps> I don't know. No, I think... I no, I'm gonna play my Sylvanas here. I can definitely play Astral Communion, but I really want to play uh, Jashar Rage Unbound. I won a few games of literally just being smart and playing like this this kind of slow and not going all out. This is obviously some sort of Evolve Shaman. And these guys cost three, so if... Ooh. Yes, please. I will take two mana crystals. And we're just gonna attack that because I don't know reasons. Uh, so next turn we cannot play anything, which is not great. But if he decides to evolve or something like that, we could steal something, which is really cool. I'm so like, I'm so pleased with myself for being legend, right, Victoria? Yes, she's she's impressed by me. And it feels great. So I, I thought I had to make a video and play like what I've been doing this when I've been legend is basically have fun. Um, should I k kill the unbound next turn? What do we do? I'm gonna kill the unbound. It's like an it's like an even scarier. So now next turn we can play the Sogat the Slitherer. Um, and after that we can play Jashad Rage Unbound, which has the coolest voice in the game so far. I even it beats Katoon or Seaton. Um which says something I don't know. Oh for fuck my life. That is a pretty big fucking big dude. But uh yes he can oh he can get through that. Oh my my friend is, is coming over he just texted I'm gonna be late because of my personality. He's he's at least he's honest. Um all right, that thing is so fucking big. But with the new, like, minion that unlocks your mana crystal, that card is actually pretty sick. Like, you can play both on turn seven and, and have... <gasps> yes. Now, we're, here he comes. Yeah, baby. Yeah. We need, like, um... We have a removal with Deathwing now, which is really good. And a taunt. Shablamo. This is why I love ancest Astral. I mean, I want to say Ancestral Communion, but Astral Communion. It is uh, so nice. It is like... It's a fun deck, so... Uh, it's just a fun deck to play. And I feel like I, I've... The, the men mentality uh, block that I had about not... Oh, shit, he's silencing that. Well, at least it looks like he has to trade into the taunt, dude. Um, and he's running out of cards, which is just fucking awesome. Whoa, that's fucking big. Um, sadly, my taunt, dude, didn't buff any of... Oh. oh. Naga Sea Witch. All right. Um, just do your thing. Oh, he killed the to totem, which is good. Shaman has gotten some incredibly good cards this... Uh, with this expansion. Uh, I don't really know what Cthulhu says just yet. I All I've been doing is just playing like kind of random and fun decks. So I gotta say, I'm really pleased with the expansion and I could definitely Deathwing next turn if I had to. 
Okay, so this this would still be a five a ten ten, right? I think so. Hmm. Do I need to even need to hero power? No, I don't know. Um, let's try. I still think it's gonna be a ten ten. Oh no! No, it's because of six six because of uh, Naga Sea Witch. It's actually interesting though. You're learning. So uh, we're gonna trade that in because it is probably gonna die, and we're gonna kill the totem. He needs a spell and to kill that. I think that was a misplay by me. I know I will hear it in the chat. Um, a fucking fire at least. This is like a crypt version of the, uh, the brand new like like the evolved deck that he played. What could we draw with five mana? I could literally just attack, go face, and Deathwing. Isn't that... I don't know, it looks weird, but... I don't know. I mean, I got Legend, so, like... I'm the coolest person alive. That's what it feels like. I know it's not... Like, it don't, please don't taunt. Okay, that's cool. It's, it's so crazy that I've been fighting for it for so long. Um... Oh, come on. Oh my god, that actually... The fuck? Alright, uh, my girlfriend is cooking as well in the background. So, I'm just gonna draw a card here. Because you get to draw a card, because you have uh, 10 mana already with the Astral Communion. Um, okay, that's good. That is at least a follow-up play that's really sticky. And he still has to deal with his Deathwing. Because I, I killed off the uh, Flame Tongue Totem. Because otherwise he will be able to kill it. And Flame Tongue Totems is just such a good card. Still, it's... When you think about it, it's just bonkers. Oh, he decided not to attack. Okay. I think I, think I lose if I if um, he does some sort of evolve shenanigans. And I, if I don't trade, I am actually might lose, which is terrifying. So, Nightmare. We have lethal next turn unless he taunts up. He could have the... Uh, the six mana taunt that gets smaller for every every uh, totem you have played. Um, so tonight it's it's uh, Schusborg, Shoes Castle here in Sweden, aka Valborgs. Um, so our friend is coming over, and we're gonna I don't really know. We're gonna we're gonna eat some some spring rolls and chillax. It's gonna be really nice. So he's killing out my Deathwing. I'm fine with that. I f I feel like. The odds of us losing this game is very small. We still have a lot of good cards left. That is not one of them though. We're just cycling. Oh, I can't play that. Well, we're gonna we're gonna clear the board. Sadly, we can't innervate the scenarios, but yeah, still has no cards. So, hmm, laughing sister can't be targeted by spells or hero power. Soft thumb of playing the hunter. My friend, is, is he laughing at me that I have ranked down? I feel like my me ranking down has nothing really to do with this. Um, let's just do this. Guarantee 8 to face. Please, no, like, no evolve business. Not even elemental destruction can save him now. And then we can scenarios and buff all these guys up. Ah, I love playing stupid decks. I'm sad that we didn't get the god opener with like dumber, double innervate on uh, turn one <laughs> to ancestral communion. <laughs> it has happened, but sadly I wasn't recording. Um, the rank is resetting tonight, but I thought I'd show you that gameplay. Um, I'll let you guys know that there will be more uh, uh, Hearthstone. And I'm going to go for Legion next on season as well. And I feel like the mental like block has lifted, so... Uh, 3,300 wins. I got almost 2k in, in the new one. And if you guys missed my uh, unboxing um, uh, of the new cards, I actually got Fendral Steighame as well. Uh, I got Ragnaros and I got Shogal and I got two Malkrok. And then I actually crafted Mukla um, and I have also crafted Nasat which is amazing, and also just shot Rage Unbound, just for this deck. So guys, I hope you enjoyed a little gameplay. I'm gonna go and have another beer, and chillax, and I'll see you guys. Really good. The world has, uh, is about to turn shit into the American like, uh, government here speaking, and they wanna see
send back the squad back to World War II with their technology and everything. Obviously, they can't 